Well, you know, I, I thought I, I t take my hat off to the Red Raiders. Uh, we thought they were a very good football team coming in, and uh, we think they're real good. You know, and I, I told our staff, you know, they were five and two when they hit the skids last year, and uh, I predicted this team is, is a bowl bound football team. There's no doubt in my mind uh, with what they had coming back and. Uh, just watching them last year, just some bad breaks down the stretch, but they were very well coached. Uh, got a, a great offensive football team. I thought they played great defense tonight, and uh, it was uh, you know a lot of hard work getting prepared for them. We knew we had to throw a lot at them, which I thought we did. Uh, but they're a very very good football team, well coached football team, and they're going to win a lot of football games this year. There's no doubt in my mind. Coach, thanks for coming out. Um, Derek Rose mentioned that playing against Tech can really get you guys ready for the next couple weeks. You got Nevada, runs a pistol. Of course, UAM, they're going to throw it a ton. How can you use this game to kind of get the defense ready for the next couple weeks? Well, I, I think it, you know, um, every year we're going to play two BCS teams. That's just kind of who we are and how we do it. And, uh, you know, I think it prepares us, you know, because you, 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 anytime you, you play against the best, and this is one of the best conferences in the country, uh, you know, it makes your game better. It prepares us for a very tough Southland Conference uh, schedule that we play, a uh, conference that we play in. Uh, and, and it doesn't get any easier. We got a, a tough Monticello team coming into our place. It's 1-0. and Then we go to Nevada. Then we play Mississippi Valley. Then we got a, a – a tough conference, as tough as any, anywhere in the country. But the, the, playing a team like Tex, Tech really prepares us uh, for the rest of our schedule. There's no doubt about it. They came out and hit their first uh, 10 third down conversions uh, on, in a row. Um, then they actually didn't get their last six. Did you guys make any kind of adjustments there? You know, we, we made a couple of adjustments at halftime, but, you know, they were making uh, – the thing that, that I felt like we had done a very poor job of in the first half, we got way too many penalties on defense that kept drives alive, and then we um, – third down conversions, we were horrible. And, and, you know, any time you don't get off the field on third down, you, uh, you know, you, you – put yourself in a hole defensively, and we did that in the first half. Now, I take my hat off to Texas Tech. That's one heck of an offense over there. There's no reason why they averaged 480 yards. And I thought coming in that Seth was as good a quarterback as I've lined up against in a long time as a defensive coach. Uh, I, I, I compared him to Drew Brees. That's who he reminds me of. You know, he's got a very quick release. He does a great job running that offense. I mean, he's got a great arm. Uh, he's very cool in the pocket. Got a lot of uh, control uh, with the offense. I mean, he's a he's a he's a big time quarterback. He he's going to play the game for a long time. There's no doubt in my mind. And uh, but I, I thought we were in position to make some plays and didn't make them, and they did. But you know, the, the, again, the penalties put us in a hole. We got way too many penalties defensively that kept drives alive, and then our third down conversion. I mean, we just we got to play better third play better third down defense than we did tonight. How do you think you guys reacted to uh, a lot of those runs out of the pistol, especially in the two or three back sets? You know what? Uh, that was a little surprising, uh, and we had a six-game breakdown on them, and I, they only had been in it 30 times in six games. That was a new wrinkle. Uh, I thought we adjusted to it and played it better, but uh, that was a little bit of surprise. That much run game out of it. They were balanced tonight, which they had been a lot more uh, uh, pass-oriented. So, but I, I thought we adjusted a lot better in the second half, and and you know had some some answers there uh, for the for the pistol for the two back and three back run game uh, that they presented tonight. But I, I will say this on your question: I thought coming in, their backs were really really good. I really did. I thought they were very good, and they had run the ball really on everybody. I mean, they had, you know, they, they made you – the one thing that's to see about this offense, you've got to stop the run. I mean, you really do. It, that sounds kind of crazy, but they got a very good – it's a simple run game, but it's very, very good, and they do a great job with it. Very compliments their passing game extremely well. Hi, Coach. Uh, I understand this was the first time that your team ran the option formation. I'm just, just going to see what you thought went right and what went wrong when doing that. Well, I, I thought uh, 
we had some, we got in some negative situations. I thought our, you know, we did it out of the pistol, and I thought the center quarterback exchange was very poor two or three, four times, and it cost us to be in, you know, second and 15, the second and 14 situations. And uh, when you run that offense, you can't get behind the chains like that, and that's what we did tonight. Okay. How good would you say uh, Texas Tech's defense defense is, and what makes you say that? What, what did you see that makes you think that? Uh, it's very good. You know, uh, to to be kind of have some fun with this. They played the run in the pass extremely well tonight. They really did. No, uh, Art's a good football coach. I've known him a long time, and that defense played extremely well tonight. And they gave us a lot of different looks, four down, three down, and, uh, you know, they played extremely well. I mean, they had great run fits, uh, defended the option well, and, uh, you know, got a lot of heat on the quarterback. They really – you know, you got to win the battle on the line of scrimmage on both sides of the ball, and they did that defensively tonight. They won the, they, they won the battle up front, and we didn't. Thanks. Coach, you said you were a defensive-minded coach. Uh, would you say your defense played better than you expected them to, or maybe not so much? Well, I mean, we gave up 44 points, so I'm not handing out any gold stars tonight, okay? But you know what? But I thought, I thought that we we could have held the score down a little bit had we had we got off the field on third down like we should have, and had we not got all the the foolish penalties. I mean, we had, I bet we had eight personal fouls. I hadn't counted them up, but it was too many of them. And, and you're not going to, you know, be able to play the kind of defense you want to play against an offense like Texas Tech's offense when you do that. When you, when you get foolish penalties that keep drives alive, and then you turn around and you don't get off the field on third down. Now, we did in the second half. I thought we did a good job of getting off the field on third down. We played much better third down defense, but uh, the foolish penalties really hurt us. But you know, when you give up 44 points, I'm not very happy about that. How would you rate your quarterback, Brad Henderson's performance tonight? You know, uh, we, we got to be better. You know, we got to be better. Uh, you know, uh, again, you know, he, uh, I thought he did some good things at times. But, uh, you know, we, 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 we took some sacks I thought we shouldn't have taken. You know, we got to get rid of the ball there. And, uh, but, you know, Brad's a good quarterback. He's the leader of a football team. Uh, I thought he played it. I thought as a team we played extremely hard. And that's a good football team. That's a good Big 12 football team. We just lined up and played, and uh, and we left Wednesday to come over here. We've had a lot of fun, and we saw we've seen West Texas. Just so y'all know, it's a lot of fun. We've eaten good too, by the way. Uh, but uh, no, he's a good quarterback. But he's better than he he's a better quarterback than he played tonight. He's better than that, and he's got to be better than that. Uh, you know, for us to do the things we want to do this football season.